One feature that separates the Osmo Action 3 from the GoPro is the ability to directly connect an external mic. With the GoPro, you have to buy the media mod and that's $80. With the Osmo Action 3, you don't need any extra equipment. All you need is a Type-C mic and you can directly connect to the camera. Or if you have a mic that uses the 3.5mm jack, you can get an adapter that turns it into a Type-C connection. DJI sells a wireless microphone and it gets great reviews, but it costs $329, the same price as the Osmo Action 3. The good news is there are much cheaper options. The IU Make VP wireless lab microphone at the time of this recording costs $31.98 on Amazon. There are links to all the products I'm mentioning in the video description if you're interested. In this mic kit, you get two wireless microphones, a receiver, two Type-C monitor earphones, a portable storage bag, an extra anti-spray sponge, two extra clips, and two Type-C charging cables. The system is plug and play. All you have to do is plug the receiver into the Type-C port in the camera and you are good to go. The receiver doesn't need to be charged, it gets its power from the camera. With two microphones, you can record two audio sources at the same time, which makes it a great setup if you're vlogging with a friend, conducting an interview, podcasting, doing a live stream. Now the microphones do need to be charged. There's a Type-C port on there to do that. You can monitor your voice in real time using the earphone. It connects directly to the microphone using the Type-C port. The wireless microphone has a range of 65 feet. If you're using it outside, you can also purchase a lavalier dead cat to reduce wind noise. On this channel, I share the latest action camera news, reviews, and how-tos. So like and subscribe to learn how to get the most out of your action camera. Now let's check out this wireless setup. Okay, I'm about four feet away from the camera, testing out the audio quality of the iMake VP wireless mic. There's no dead cat on there right now, and it's a little bit of a breeze. Next, I'll test it out with the dead cat. Okay, the dead cat is on. Let's see if that makes any difference in the sound quality. Should recording outside, at, still at four feet. Now I'll go down to the other end of the park there, maybe about 30 feet or so, and we'll see how the mic sounds. Okay, I'm about 30 feet away, checking out the auto quality of the wireless mic. I'm curious to see what the sound quality is gonna be like. I'll check it out when I put the video together. To learn more about your Osmo Action 3, check out this video here.